Hello, friends. Welcome to my Royal Family News Channel. Before we dive into today's video, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so and turn on notifications. Now, let's get started. Recent remarks made by Princess and have stirred up quite a commotion within the royal family, making Queen Camilla's position feel increasingly precarious. Anne's comments, which express her dissatisfaction with the current state of the firm, have dealt a significant blow to Camilla's already shaky public image. Despite her low approval ratings among the British public, Camilla seemed to have found some acceptance as the Duchess of Cornwall, especially after and subtly endorsed Catherine, Princess of Wales. This raises questions about Camilla's future role in the monarchy. Camilla has retreated from public life this week, indicating that her insecurities linger. It must be challenging for her, the woman who once schemed to become queen consort, to watch Catherine's popularity grow week by week. Catherine has emerged as the favored choice for the future, embodying a modern monarchy that resonates with the public. A recent critique pointed out that the monarchy needs to connect with a community that reflects their values and progressive ideals, which and did not name directly but implied. Camilla's past controversies have been seen as conflicting with contemporary royal values, while Catherine represents sophistication and responsibility. The perception is that Camilla has lost her standing in the royal family, and it's unclear how she can regain it as Catherine continues to shine as a potential future queen. Camilla's role as queen consort remains largely undefined, and even though she has carved out a space for herself, her relationship with the public feels indifferent. Catherine's active involvement in social causes and her commitment to family have won the hearts of many, signaling her increasing influence. This shift is not just about personal popularity, it signifies a turning point for the royal family, demonstrating that they need Catherine more than ever. Camilla, often viewed as the family's toxic matriarch, has struggled to assert herself in a changing landscape where Catherine seems to be the one gaining favor. Camilla's recent decision to withdraw from public life speaks volumes about her current standing as public opinion shifts toward Catherine. The public's perception of Camilla is tainted by her history, particularly her past relationship with Charles during his marriage to Diana. Despite the years that have passed, royal titles cannot erase the public's disdain, and Anne's comments have only exacerbated these old wounds. Camilla's attempts to engage with the public often come across as forced and insincere, demonstrating her difficulty in fulfilling the role she fought so hard to attain. In contrast, Catherine has naturally risen in the public's esteem, earning their respect through her genuine efforts in various charitable causes, including mental health and children's issues. She embodies the values that resonate with the public, while Camilla remains ensconced in her privileged existence, disconnected from the very people she hopes to engage. This dynamic further solidifies the sentiment that Camilla may never truly be seen as a queen. Social media reactions reveal that many see her as an outdated figure, serving more as an ornament in the royal family than an integral part of it. With Catherine poised to become the apparent heir, Camilla's moment in the spotlight seems to be dwindling. As Catherine steps into the forefront, Camilla's past aspirations of being a partner to Charles seem to fade. Anne's incisive analysis highlights the vulnerabilities within Camilla and emphasizes the monarchy's need to evolve and connect with its subjects. Ultimately, it suggests that Camilla has become irrelevant, while Catherine stands as the future, a remnant of a bygone era that the British public wishes to move past. The prospects of Camilla remaining queen consort appear to be diminishing, with tensions among the royals becoming apparent. Anne's candid remarks have further chipped away at Camilla's already fragile position within the royal inner circle. This narrative paints a picture of a warrior queen, securing her right to the throne but losing favor in the court. This is not merely a casual critique, it signifies a profound shift in royal dynamics.